Hello, and welcome back to our channel. If you're passionate about green energy, then you've clicked on the right video. Today, we're going to delve into the exciting world of hydrogen power. We've got a jam-packed agenda for you. First, we'll start by debunking the top H2 myth that has been circulating online. We believe it's crucial to separate fact from fiction when it comes to this powerful alternative energy source. Then, we'll shift gears and take a look back at 2023, a landmark year for hydrogen power. We'll count down the top five events that made headlines, shaped policies, and propelled the industry forward. So, buckle up and get ready as we explore the truth behind hydrogen power and celebrate its achievements in 2023. Don't forget to hit that like button if you're excited to learn more. Let's dive right in. Let's dive into our first myth, hydrogen is not safe. This is a common misconception, but the reality is quite different. Green hydrogen, produced from renewable sources, is actually safer than many traditional fuels. Hydrogen is non-toxic, and its emissions are primarily water vapor. If there's a spill, it's toxin-free, unlike traditional fuel spills. Hydrogen's lightness means it disperses quickly in the air, reducing ignition risks. It needs an oxygen concentration of 18% to 59% to explode, whereas gasoline only needs 1% to 3%. Additionally, a hydrogen fire produces less radiant heat than a gasoline fire, lowering secondary fire risks. So, while safety measures are necessary for all energy forms, hydrogen isn't inherently dangerous. In fact, when done right, it has several safety benefits over traditional fuels. All right, moving on to an intriguing section the top strangest news in hydrogen. Kicking off at number five, we have a surprising story involving chicken feathers and renewable hydrogen fuel cells. Yes, you heard that right, chicken feathers. These are usually incinerated as waste, but researchers from ETH Zurich have found a way to repurpose them. Composed mostly of keratin, chicken feathers can be transformed into thin fibers, which can then be used as the semi-permeable membrane in hydrogen fuel cells. These membranes play a crucial role in fuel cells, allowing protons to pass through while blocking electrons, thereby generating electricity. Most traditional membranes are made from toxic forever chemicals, making this development particularly exciting for cleaner and cheaper hydrogen fuel cells. The keratin-based membrane, a joint development by ETH Zurich and Nanyang Technological University Singapore, NTU is not only less toxic, but also approximately three times cheaper than traditional membranes. Plus, it could be used in water splitting or electrolysis due to its proton permeability. This innovative use of chicken feathers could significantly reduce CO2 emissions and the overall carbon footprint in the energy sector. Quite a remarkable feat, wouldn't you say? The research was published in a CS Applied Materials and Sciences. And there you have it, number five in our countdown of the strangest yet fascinating news in the world of hydrogen energy. Moving on, let's unveil number four in our countdown, our favorite H2 tech for 2023. The spotlight shines on Sun Hydrogen's larger green hydrogen generator. This is our top hydrogen tech pick for 2023. Sun Hydrogen has revolutionized the renewable energy sector with the launch of its larger green hydrogen generator system. This system incorporates innovative nanoparticle technology, setting a new standard in the renewable energy field. The system's design is unique, featuring a solar panel that houses several hydrogen generators, offering 16 times more area for hydrogen generation compared to previous models. This significant increase in area aims to boost production rates substantially. The prototype system uses solar energy to split water molecules, leading to the production of high-purity renewable hydrogen and oxygen. And here's the kicker, it can operate continuously even when sunlight is not available by using renewable grid electricity from wind or hydropower sources. With this cutting-edge technology, Sun Hydrogen brings us a step closer to achieving commercial-scale hydrogen panels. Their remarkable strides in innovation are why we've selected them as our top hydrogen tech pick for 2023. Next, we tackle myth two, green hydrogen is too expensive. This is a pervasive myth, suggesting that green hydrogen isn't a feasible alternative to fossil fuels due to its cost. However, this isn't necessarily the case. Green hydrogen production costs have been on a consistent downward trend over recent years. According to various reports, including those from CRU Group, IRENA, and RMI, green hydrogen costs could drop to around $1.50 to $2 per kilogram by 2050. In some locations, these costs could fall even sooner within the next five years. As renewable energy prices continue to drop, 
the cost of producing green hydrogen from wind and solar power is also anticipated to decrease. A report by Bloomberg NEF even suggests that the cost of green hydrogen could fall by up to 85% by 2050, making it competitive with natural gas. So, while green hydrogen production is currently more expensive than traditional fuels, ongoing advancements in technology and growing economies of scale are rapidly closing this gap. Therefore, dismissing green hydrogen as too expensive is a myth that doesn't hold up under scrutiny. Let's move on to number three in our top picked hydrogen news for 2023. This one takes us into the automotive world with the most read hydrogen car article of the year, Toyota's innovative approach to carbon neutrality. Toyota is expanding its approach to achieving carbon neutrality by developing a new vehicle that features a hydrogen combustion engine, a departure from its existing fuel cell car. This innovative move stems from Toyota's belief that relying solely on electric vehicles may not be the most sustainable solution. The company recently showcased this strategy with the unveiling of the Corolla Cross H2 concept vehicle. This model features a modified version of the 1.6-liter turbocharged three-cylinder engine seen in other Toyota models, but it's been adapted to use hydrogen as fuel. This hydrogen combustion engine offers several advantages, such as quick refueling and a reduced need for rare metals compared to EVs. These benefits could potentially make it a more sustainable option in the long run. Currently, the Corolla Cross H2 is undergoing real-world evaluation and will soon be tested under winter road conditions in northern Japan. This development marks an exciting turning point in Toyota's journey towards carbon neutrality and the evolution of hydrogen-powered vehicles. Unveiling the number two story in hydrogen development of 2023. A massive discovery of natural hydrogen reshaping our energy landscape. Hydrogen has always been a key player in the energy sector due to its high energy content and clean burning nature. However, most of the focus until now has been on producing hydrogen artificially, often overlooking the existence of natural hydrogen. This is primarily because it's rare to find substantial quantities of hydrogen naturally, as it tends to float upwards until it escapes into space. But an incredible discovery in France is set to change this narrative. In May 2023, while assessing the risk of fire damp pockets in the abandoned mines of the Lorraine region, La France d'Energy, FDE stumbled upon a vast deposit of natural hydrogen. This unexpected find, possibly the largest in Europe, could significantly bolster the continent's clean energy transition efforts. The Lorraine Basin deposit is estimated to contain about 46 million tons of hydrogen, roughly half the current global hydrogen production. Unlike hydrogen produced through conventional methods, this naturally occurring gas requires minimal energy for extraction, doesn't need water, and takes up little land. This makes it a truly transformative asset in our energy scenario. Let's debunk another myth. Green hydrogen production requires too much water. This misconception suggests that the production of green hydrogen consumes an excessive amount of water. However, the reality is quite different. Green hydrogen is a clean energy solution that not only reduces carbon emissions, but also minimizes impact on water supplies. It's produced by separating hydrogen from oxygen in water using renewable energy sources like wind, solar, or hydro. According to the Environmental Working Group, the freshwater used for hydrogen production is less than 1% of the total global freshwater consumption. This is a significantly lower percentage than many traditional fossil fuel methods. A 2021 study published in Fuel Cells Bulletin corroborates this assessment. The study highlights several potential benefits for the water sector. These include improved wastewater treatment efficiency, better drinking water supplies in arid regions, and optimal use of seawater resources. Therefore, the claim that green hydrogen production requires too much water is not supported by the available evidence. Finally, we have reached our top pick number five in the countdown. Biden administration's $7 billion pledge marks a historic milestone in hydrogen energy development. In a historic move that has become the most significant event in the hydrogen energy sector, the Biden-Harris administration has pledged an astounding $7 billion towards the establishment of clean hydrogen hubs. This investment, which aims to produce over 3 million metric tons of clean hydrogen annually, is expected to attract over $40 billion in private investments and create tens of thousands of job opportunities. This commitment forms part of a larger $65 billion clean energy initiative, highlighting the administration's dedication to addressing the climate crisis, enhancing energy security, and investing in clean manufacturing. The crucial role of these hydrogen hubs in establishing a nationwide hydrogen economy and promoting the use of eco-friendly energy sources cannot be understated. 
Their significance in reshaping the landscape of hydrogen energy is truly monumental. And that brings us to the end of our countdown of the top hydrogen news of 2023. This year has been an exciting ride for the hydrogen energy sector, with groundbreaking discoveries, significant investments, and enlightening facts. A personal favorite of mine is Toyota's hydrogen combustion engine, their H2 Corolla Cross. But what about you? What was your favorite development in the hydrogen world this year? Please share your thoughts and favorite articles from 2023 in the comments section below. Don't forget to smash that subscribe button for more updates on the hydrogen energy sector and other clean energy trends. All article links and resources mentioned in this video can be found in the description below. Thank you for joining us today, and we look forward to seeing you next time.